lifestyle what's going on big up to everybody out there in vlogland respect 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 as always so yo what are we up to today so listen i'm away to work today got a text from a good friend of mine another good friend of mine kyle greg and he was like yo nick we have the gt3 today you want to shoot a quick vlog i'm like yo why not i mean who wouldn't want to be doing a vlog on a gt3 you see me so today i'm just gonna get into it quick i'm not even going to make this intro too long you see me peeps remember this weekend is my earth strong may 14th at six kagila we roll out come hold vibes with us you don't know the vibe so yo we're going to get into the vlog now let's find out what this gt3 is all about let's get the perspective from a from a wicked race car driver like kyle greg let's hear what his thoughts is on the car what power the car is packing what kind of handling the car of all of that type of stuff so let's go Machine, Kylo, so I'm going. Mm -hmm. Big up. What you say now? Talk to me, no man. What you <laughs> say? You know what? <laughs> if I like it, it's sweet. Kind of like a dream, better than a race car for sure. You know, that's the first thing I said on the intro of the blog a while ago. You've driven many cars. It's your car. What, what, what's the take on this push? I mean, it's still breaking in the engine. Yeah. But the brakes are some ceramic brakes, so, so those take some time to break in also. But on the highway and stuff, and going on the fast sweeping corners, it definitely has so much grip. Mm -hmm. um, considering it's rear wheel drive and the engine is in the back, it just hooks up. Um, yes, we're on some Goodyear 80 treadwear tires, which yeah. also help benefit also. But the aerodynamics on this car is, you definitely feel it. I mean, at Jam West, when I drive in the Radical, Mm -hmm. We tend to feel the downforce and stuff. Yeah. Just like this car on the highway, it's amazing how much aero is that the aero package and everything. It's just crazy. Yeah, the center of gravity of the car. Too yeah, when you go in, when you go into the corner and you feel like the car is going to understeer, and you feel like the wing take grip you and you just plant your foot back down on the gas and it yeah. just hooks up and goes. It's where you. I haven't found a limit yet, <laughs> put no, it that yeah, way. Because but you, you wouldn't remember, you're breaking it in now. Yeah, I mean, but once once you get on the gas and power it through the corner, it just grips. It's not sliding, traction control, it's not even kicking in as yet because the car is just, just meant to go. <laughs> the Porsche is known for the PDK transmission, which is what this car has. How you find the gearing down and everything like that? It's quick. Um, from as I select it, yeah. it actually shifts faster than the race car, to be honest. Um, it's very quick. I mean, there's no, it's probably like a tenth of a second or less um, in terms of shifting gears. Mm -hmm. um, but, and then it blips for you. The blip is very aggressive. So when you're well, braking hard, it, it goes rrr, 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 like it, it, it gears on hard for you. So it's, it's proper, proper yeah. transmission. Do you think you need anything else around town? No. Okay. I mean, the power is there, the power to weight ratio is it's fast. I mean, Considering this one, I know in the, the, the two Turbo S that are here, I can imagine the power that those cars have because this is moving and those cars have basically 150 horsepower or more. I yeah. can imagine how that feels. Yo, come give me a quick walk around on the car now. Not too crazy, you don't know. Kyle is like my brother. Well, not like my brother, okay. Kyle is my brother. And Kyle showed me up and said, Yo, Nick, get a quick, quick vlog of the car. So let me show you the interior. It has the yellow stitching. Turn up the exposure on this for you so you can see yellow stitching with the carbon fiber seats and I mean with a car like this you need seats like this for kind of like pin you down because when you're going around the corner it's so beautiful yo. Yeah, there's a, in, in choosing the spec you have obviously the luxury seats right. and the racing seats. Um, the racing seats have its advantages, the right. looks, but the luxury spec basically you can adjust. Mm -hmm. This you can adjust. Right. So you can't lean back or anything or just get comfortable. It's just one straight design. So but this is a this is a 2022 yeah. GT3, right? Not a lot of these are in the island. So I mean, it's pretty much well, like a collector's edition. Yeah, I mean, it's crazy because I mean, ATL. I think they get maybe one slot every two years. And um, but yeah, it's just I mean, they're collector's items now because the demand for them are so high. Right. Um, <laughs> the more the people that have called. And ask me first if we want to buy it, but like not yet. <laughs> so yo, you carry, you carry, you carry gear for pulling it. Yeah, he went with me this. Dad went with me this morning. 
But he, he what was his reaction to you driving? He was looking for the horseshoe the, the bar. bar the whole time. Yeah. But, but and it, you know, he, he doesn't understand the aerodynamics of the car as yet. So when I pushed into the corners, he was just like, ah! yeah. <laughs> I, you know, you know, I was like, Dad, it's under control. <laughs> Yeah, man. No, but it's good. Yeah, man. So it Which comes is, with. Oh, go ahead. The car game in Jamaica has definitely taken off. I yeah. Mean, so only for nice cars coming in now, which is nice. You know, it's nice to see on the road. Mm-hmm. Poor should the poor should the bad boy for the road still. I I feel so. That's my that's one of my takes. I mean, this is a this is a driver's dream right here, and I mean you're hearing it from Kyle that actually drives at Dover. He's one of the baddest drivers at Dover, and I tell you, when I mean, tell you so that carrier bad, it bad. Braking is superb. I mean, as you can see, this car is well specced, well specced out, and also designed to be pushed on the highway at certain speeds and certain intervals. Give you a quick close up on the wheels. These are 21 inch wheels wrapped with 315 Goodyear Eagle F1. I mean, I tell you, them tires, 80 treaders, and them sticky carbon ceramic brake. You see me as you can see, look on it, that's how you can know the ceramic, you see the whole um, the rotors going to be bedded in right now And it's a chalk grey as you can see I'm going to tell you, it's just, just a sweet machine overall Decided to come and give you guys a vlog because you know how it got already, content is king So, I'm going to go for a pulse shortly, see what it is like around town, not too crazy But yeah, I don't know the vibe, lifestyle, I hate this Let's go Start up, let me hear it. Because it does the back fenders, the guards, it yeah. don't, don't have any, so it sounds like a race car with a ting, 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 yeah. the stones. Well, you know what's crazy? What? I was looking for the whole ship bar that Gary was looking for. <laughs> <laughs> I realized that this is the only thing that they give you. Oh, my design, wicked man. <laughs> Doing nothing over here, so everything was automated. Does it fail? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, man. Put a smile on your face. What's the, what's the response from the crowd? Since you've been driving, it's like people on the road. Why? Bear thumbs up. I did that. Right? Oh, but if you if you're 
if you're powering it and you and you stamp on the brake, yeah. it looks for like that automatically. Okay. We're not going in. I carry a fit in bro. <laughs> Yo, Yo, know, trust me, love it, man, love it, man, love it. Like these cars put a smile on your face. Yeah, as you can see, a smile here, there, isn't it? Mad man. Just want to give you guys a quick look on the interior again, while we stop to go, and you know the seats are very comfortable. They might have that bucket shape and the common fiber is back. Oh, it doesn't have any space around here, but for passengers. So. Xander, Xander loves his Xander. He's, yeah, he, he's, he's on every day. Yeah, he drives his own basically every day, and he loves that car, man. I tell you, he he, he enjoys it. it. You know, he gets he gets thrills and spills just talking about it. You know, he just he gets goosebumps. He loves it that much. Yo, big up to Kyle again, you don't know the vibe. Yep, Respect, yeah. it was a joy. And we don't have many more. When it breaks, you know, want to go on the highway. Alright? <laughs> <laughs> so, yo, big up. Big up. <gasps> Lifestyle, what go on? Yo, was at, my, was at the shop a while ago and got a call from a good British in our mind saying, yo, the GT3 is on the showroom. So, yo, I say, yo, let me just kickstart the vlog with a vibe Show you guys a quick look around Cause you don't know, when they're on the showroom it just look different than when it's actually on the road And then when it comes on the road then we get a follow up vlog on it So yo, big up for this feature again So yo, I'm gonna go inside and show you guys a quick walk around Talk to Maurice at Porsche today about it And give you guys a full scoop on what this car is about to hit the Jamaican streets Wow Yes sir! Oh, man himself, what's going on bro? I'm great, I'm great man. So this is Maurice. Tell me about a little bit about this car now bro. Well guys. Virgin, listen man. Ladies and gentlemen, it's here, the GT3. Uh, only one in the in the country right now. Very, very special. I mean it's a 503 horsepower, 4 litre flat 6. Mad. G0 to 62.7. Nothing like this on the road. It's crazy. We have it in the sharp blue. Carbon fiber wind mirrors. Carbon fiber roof. Trust the old me. key, shape of the car. Yeah. Attention to details. That's what you get with Porsche. Attention to details and performance. Nothing like a Porsche. So the GT3, signature round, uh, exhaust in the middle, aggressive rear diffuser. You coming around, you got a 21 Pilot Sport Cup 2s yeah. in the back, 20 inch up front. This man, full carbon fiber bucket seats. Wow. With your blue stitch yellow seat belts. Mad with mm. the built in roll cage. Attention to detail. So, this is a factory roll cage, right? Yes, sir. Factory. Straight Mad. factory. And it has a manual transmission. Yeah, as well. and if you notice uh, with the wing, the swan neck design by Porsche. Yeah. You know, aiding with your downforce and everything. Bridging this car is just at a whole another level. Your Porsche, welcome. Lights come around the front here, gets even more interesting. Mm -hmm. Put your ear vents in the front, 
creating that more dome force when you drive. Ooh. This car is supposed to be a sick on the road. Oh my gosh, man. 0 to 16, 2.7, bridging that. 0 to 16, 2.7, 2.7 seconds, man. This is man. crazy. So you know, Four liter flat, six. Had to pass through bridging. to get a look on this car. Trust me when I tell you that lifestyle. When I tell you the car is a beauty. Oh, you know, you're not short of stopping for Nick, right? What size rotors will you have? 410 millimeters on the front oh. and around the back. That's 390. Yo, style, you know, I had to give you guys this quick and fast. Maurice is here at the dealership and I say, yo, had to come and look on this car. The only one in the island, the like only this one in the right island. Now. Full rev out to 9,000 RPMs, man. Check that shot. Sweet. 10,000 RPM. 10,000 RPM, yeah. Mad. See it now? Yeah man, I don't know the vibe. Had to pass through with respect to Maurice again. If you guys need a Porsche and you can hit him up. Big up right. Nick Lou. Yeah man, respect lifestyle. Give you guys a quick look at the cinematic of the car now. Yeah.